so hello everyone this is Ipthinu today I am back with another video and in this video I, I will show you how you can add HTML CSS and JavaScript and you can also able to make a custom CSS section so I think uh, you can see a page and this page uh, below it page by so you know uh, in every landing page there's some limitation so uh, besides this, in paste by they also give you an opportunity to add custom CSS, HTML, and JavaScript. So you can see here is an um, this landing page uh, actually made for an uh, ingredient background. So here you can see some ingredient, and for each ingredient, there's some short description. So this section works like if someone click on water. So when you click or hover on water in the right side you can see it it will show you only this uh, ingredient details if you click on here and then it will show you like uh, another description or short description for another ingredient and if when you click on another ingredient that is all ingredients works for individual and all ingredients carry their in individual description Okay, you can see there's works uh, like uh, something that's uh, I think this feature are not available in Pesla. That's why I'm going to make this video so that you can also understand how you can also able this type able uh, to create this type of uh, section. And let's go. So now I'm going to uh, I'm going in my Pesla editor. You can see. Here is the page. So here uh, I'm going to show you uh, from beginning to end how you can add this type of section. So here you can see in a section and now I'm going to delete this one. Then I will show you how you can do that. First you need to click here at element. So here is some element and in paste by you can you need to search like HTML, then you will find this HTML or liquid. So using this uh, element, you can uh, do your custom HTML code or liquid code. Okay. So click here and it will not work. You need to click open code editor. Then it will come with a pop-up and here this text box for uh, write your HTML or liquid code. So let's push our HTML or liquid code here. So here in this notepad, uh, some liquid and HTML code that already I did. Okay. So copy and paste it here. Let's click save. So it looks like that. Okay. And in sec in our section or row, you can see he is uh, under row. So if you want, you can use some margin or pad padding. So here I am going to use some uh, padding. Okay. Okay. Now, so it's time to add. So our HTML code already added here and you see all uh, some in all our ingredient loops here. Now uh, I'm going to add CSS. So click add custom code here. You can see. Then you need to add CSS here. So here's some previous CSS. I'm going to remove that and some JavaScript. I'm also going to remove that. Let's copy our all CSS from here. Okay. Copy and push it here. So click save. Now we need to click save and publish. So whatever you see, I just added uh, HTML code and CSS code. Let, let's now it's time to add javascript okay so here some javascript and let add those javascript here i think uh, these are the javascript let's click save 
<coughs> so our HTML code, our CSS here, our JavaScript in the right side, you can see they are all they already mentioned that you can add here custom JavaScript, you can add here custom CSS, and here you can add you custom HTML or liquid code. Let's click save and publish. I think it will work. Let's see. Let's click here view like this. Uh, see, it uh, works uh, very nicely. When you click here, it will only show the clicked or selected ingredient details. When you click here, it only show your uh, selective ingredient description. What if uh, it looks good in desktop? Let's see how it looks in our mobile view. I think it should be fine in both uh, desktop and laptop. So let increase 75% and see it's good for both mobile and for desktop. So I think this video will help a lot because uh, you should uh, need to know that there is a cool feature of this file. Uh, page builder so they will give you an opportunity to add HTML CSS and JavaScript code so I think this video will help a lot thanks a lot and see you uh, in the next video and till now take care bye bye